Hi Scorpio, welcome back to my channel Little Love Stories. Today I'm going to do your weekly love reading for the month of October. Keep in mind that these readings are general. This may be resonate with you or maybe not resonate with each and every one of you. If it resonates with you, you can take guidance from this reading and if it not resonate with you, you can simply ignore it. And for covering every area of your love life, I'm going to use this pattern. This spread, this is easy for both of us to understand what is happening in your person's life, in your life. I will take four cards for your partners, feeling attention and concentration. Four card for your feeling, attention, and concentration, and two card for mutual energies. Okay, Scorpio, let's get started. What is the Scorpio person's feelings towards Scorpio? What are the Scorpio person's feeling, attention, and concentration towards Scorpio? What are the Scorpio person's feeling and attentions towards Scorpio? And we are having here three of wands, ace of wands, nine of cups. Page of Pentacles. So, what are the Scorpio's feelings toward this person? What are the Scorpio's feelings and thinking toward this person? We are having here Ace of Pentacles, Six of Swords, the Hanged Man, Queen of Pentacles. So, what are the mutual energies? Page of Cups and Ten of Swords. These are your cards and sign that could relate to your person. It could be any Pisces with this hanged man. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius with this six of swords and ten of swords. It is Leo, Sagittarius with this three of wand, ace of wands. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces with this nine of cups and page of cups. Taurus, Virgo and Capricorn with this page of pentacles and ace of pentacles. Okay, let's talk about your person's feeling. Scorpio and your person want to see you because they feel in this week they will feel a passion there is some kind of passion switched inside them for you and this passion is like attraction towards your physiques attraction towards you and that attraction is that much they really want to travel towards you they really want to meet you they really they are watching you from distance they are dreaming about you and the the passion they they can't control their feelings and their passion that they have towards you and that's why this person want to travel towards you and this person is dreaming about you how to have you how to talk to you how to when they meet they are keep imagining the moment then when they met you and when they talk to you and they when they see you after a long time when they when they they finally get to touch you this person actually want to touch you want to they want to have you in their arms that kind of passion switched on in this person and this person is dreaming about you thinking about you and smiling in their imagination to think about you because this person is so interested in you they're still so interested in you they feel this uh, enthusiasm they feel this excitement in them they are so happy, they are so overwhelmed with their with feelings, they are so passionate and they are so like excited and they want to, to uh, talk to you. They, their feelings are really pure and uh, over overwhelming and uh, overflowing feelings for you and they want to offer you. They are, they, are, they are so interested in you and there is some kind of uh, passion switched on in this person and this passion is really out of their control and they are so like uh, dive into their imagination and in, in, the, in their dreams they are dreaming about you and they are taking actions toward this passion and this, these dreams they are not just dreaming they want to travel towards you they are watching you from distance they, they want to see you they want to talk to you and this person feeling a huge passion towards you and this is your first card like uh, this is this person really want to see you and this person is so excited to have you this person is so excited to meet you and this person is imagining and dreaming about you so let's see what is in your feelings and you want uh, someone offer you love stability like strong you want a relationship with a strong foundation step by step you want a relationship you want a commitment you want a clarity in your life you want someone to offer you love commitment and you know uh, the foundation is strong you want a strong uh, relationship and you find a solution you you find this thing as your solution and you are moving forward in your life 
you really want to move forward in your life and but the thing is that you feel stuck but you are trying your best to move forward with this hanged man this is a major card if you are trying your best to move on uh, from the situation putting everything behind finding a solution and you find a solution but the thing is that you feel this in this week in these seven days you feel some kind of stuckness some kind of uh, uh, like uh, holding something back and you are holding on your love you are holding on your pentacles so tight and you are just paying attention on your love you are spending on yourself you are uh, like uh, uh, nurturing yourself you are uh, grooming and make over yourself and uh, right now you are uh, paying attention on your uh, on yourself and you are so real you are not wearing any kind of mask and you you feel a little bit stuck in in this uh, uh, in these days you will feel stuckness and you want you will find a solution solution of uh, like this is a, a fine solution and you are moving forward in your life but still something is holding you back and you are nurturing yourself and uh, in your person's feeling they are like little bit immaturity in this person this person is uh, unexperienced this person is immature and this person is a little bit childish and their feelings uh, they don't know how to act uh, properly and how to act wisely how to act uh, like uh, in a mature way in front of you they are they are a little bit childish and immature and their love is like uh, they offering offering you love but not the way you uh, want them they are not doing the way you want and you feel some kind of uh, like this person or maybe you this is these are mutual cards so Ten of Swords. It's not a good ta- card, actually. It's, it's it's pain. It's harsh. It's sadness. Like you are in in you feel some kind of sadness. You feel stuck, and you also feel some kind of sadness in you. After maybe after this person uh, showing you and uh, their love, the way they they propose you, maybe you you. feel disappointed and there is some kind of this you know this these are strong energies ten of sword uh, this 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 is a strong energy this is a sad sadness you 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 feel sad inside you are facing a uh, you know uh, you will uh, feel this sadness in this way even in your cards i am not uh, seeing any other, another negative card but uh, somehow you feel sad but n- not in your chart yet not your person side not your side but there is stuckness but stuckness is different but feeling sad is totally different something is happen that make you sad or maybe there is some kind of mood swing and you sad from nowhere i think you feel sadness in you but but from from nowhere okay let's see what else we have for you scorpio what else for scorpio what else for scorpio and we are having here nine of swords oh, five of cups and as a outcome three of pentacles well that's complicated after offering you love in their childish way in their immature way they will sleep less they will in some kind of uh, what must i say depression the nightmare they feel these kind of feelings after they propose you something is happen between both of you like that's how this is complicated with this five of cups you will trap into your past and uh, this is in a loop you will regret what happened in past this person is depressed this person feel anxiety and depression and you maybe this person is like feeling like that you are in some kind of depression and anxiety and you are in your past in some kind of nostalgia some kind of regrets uh, you are feeling and you are trapped into your past and uh, as a outcome everything will be fine this sadness came from your you know past because i think you are sad because of your past and 
in in these seven days in this week you will feel you will find a project you will find a new project to work on and uh, you will work on a new project and you will put everything behind like you are finding a solution this stuckness will gone you will find a solution and you will find a new project to work on and uh, you will like keep yourself busy to overcome this past energy and this uh, ton of sword energy you will find a, a new project and you will get busy and uh, you should this is also an indication and advice for you to engage yourself somewhere else these are your cards and let's see what advice messages i should have for you so let's see what advice messages in the end for you spend some time with nature believe in destiny pray to the god for the peace in your life spend some time with your mother these are few advice messages in the end and a summary of your reading this this person feel a spark of passion spark of energy switch tone inside them for you and they are dreaming and thinking uh, about you and uh, they they are a little bit immature and childish and you are a little bit stuck somewhere you try your best to find a solution you are nursing yourself you are paying attention on yourself but still you will uh, trap into past but in these uh, seven upcoming seven days in this week you will find a new project and you will find yourself uh, busy uh, you you will be busy and uh, your attention will be uh, converted in your project on in your work and there is a slight possibility that you will find some third party in this relationship this is maybe the way you are this person is uh, not so happy and with this uh, nine of sword this person feel some kind of uh, sleepless and sl losing their nights over you maybe they find out like you are are still in in your past you are still in your past relationships and that's uh, a nightmare for this person there is a, an, a, also another possibility these are few summaries of your reading hope this is helpful for you if it helpful for you uh, support my channel and tell me in comments thank you so much for your time and your attention god bless you bye